All right, if you've never been to Iolani Palace or you haven't been since you were a little kid, shame on you. That's right. At least that's what the highly trained docents told us when we stopped by. And hey, you know what? On certain days, you can actually take the entire family for free. Mm -hmm. Take a look at our latest trip on Oahu for under 20. Family Fun Day, by the way, can also be educational. Iolani Palace, by the way, was rebuilt in 1879. King Kalakaua did it to build up the prestige of the Hawaiian Kingdom. Part of the reason for this is that he was the first monarch to travel around the world. I can't wait to see inside. Let's go. Before you can even set foot inside the palace, you got to cover your shoes to protect the floors. That's right. So, here's a note. Do not wear high heels like I did because they're harder to cover. This is the Grand Hall. If you were coming to the palace, you would enter the front door, and the first thing that you would be impressed with is this magnificent Grand Hall with the grand staircase leading up to the private part of the palace. And what's interesting about this is that, believe it or not, the treads here are original. All right, Fred, so this is where the king did most of his business, right? Oh, yes. You know, it wasn't all fun and games in a palace. The king did his very serious work. I mean, he was king, and he had to do a lot of serious work. And to help him make sure he spelled his words correctly, look at what we got here. Edition number one, numero uno, of Webster's Unabridged Dictionary. Wow. You said a lot of people feel a profound sense of sadness in this room. Why is yes, that? Yes, yes. When the queen was arrested in 1893. They, they, they thought she was implicated in the overthrow of uh, uh, attempted counter-revolution. They arrested the queen and imprisoned her here in her own palace. And, you know, when you come into this room, you know, I, I still have that feeling of, uh, of sadness. So what are we looking at here? We're looking at what is known as the imprisonment quilt. On special days, you know, among other things, she would ask for needle and thread, and Queen Lilio Kalani actually sewed those four pieces in there, and others saw what she did. They said, oh, your majesty, may we add to yours? And over the years, all of these little pieces combined represents hundreds, maybe thousands of Hawaiians and others who wanted to be part of the Queen's quilt. What would you say to people out there who haven't been to Iolani Palace in a long time? Say it, say it to them. You know, don't feel bad. There are so many people who haven't come here. You know, bring your kids. It's a perfect place for Kama Aina Sunday. See, he, he calmed that down because his initial reaction was, What? <laughs> Shame, Shame on, on you! you. <laughs> <laughs> but just a reminder, Kama Aina Sunday is free for the entire family. It happens once a month, usually on the first Sunday. If you go at any other time, it will cost you $6 for adults and $3 for kids 5 to 12. All this week, we will be taking you to places that you can take your entire family of four for under $20. Stay tuned to Sunrise to find out where we are headed tomorrow. That's right, but for now, let's head over to Taiza. Taiza, what's going on? Uh, Steve, we're starting to get very busy now.